terrorist cyber asset seized, California's digital privacy law, and more on this week's Security Weekly. Hello again, I'm Sasha, and welcome to the only place where you get the latest in what's happening across the world in technology and security. It's a big win for the good guys. The U.S. Justice Department has announced that they have seized and dismantled three terror financing campaigns. The terror groups included Hamas's military wing, Al-Qaeda, and the Islamic State. All three of them were using cryptocurrency on social media to gain followers and raise funds for their terrorist activities. Universities and the whole education sector has suffered quite a lot in the last few years, but especially recently. Ransomware is often the main source of pain for educational institutions. Just recently in June, UCSF was a victim of a ransomware attack, which led to the university to pay over $1.1 million to criminals after discovering critical academic data related to COVID-19 research had been encrypted. In fact, many research departments at universities have seen a spike of attacks by criminals during the onset of the COVID-19 pandemic. Though the suffering of the education sector has carried on for many years. According to a recent study by the agency Top Line Comms, over a third of universities in the UK have been victims of ransomware attacks. What's worrying and often forgotten is that once an institution has been attacked, it could still lead to further targeting. What's best is, of course, a multi-layered strategy, ensuring a combination of safeguards, which include staff training, as well as a network and identity security solution. Although already in effect since January of 2020 this year, CCPA, which is California's landmark digital privacy law, a final list of regulations that guide businesses and consumers has come into force last Friday. This is another step towards giving one in 10 Americans, only California residents, the right to request their data be deleted from e-commerce websites and social media. The final rule set out how a business must provide consumers with timely notice at or before the point of data collection. Furthermore, about the categories of personal information they're collecting and how it will be used. The law is highly significant as it covers tech platforms, ride hailing services, and other organizations which collect personal data for commercial purposes. It will certainly have an impact on big tech and the wider world of Silicon Valley. And that's a wrap for this week's episode. Thanks so much for watching. Remember to keep extra careful out there with all your online and digital activities. Be safe, stay healthy, and see you next time.